Hello, and welcome to another edition of Day Drinking with Kevin. I'm your host, Kevin McGuire, and today we're going to continue our series on what's in my glass. Last time I talked about a wine that had hints of strawberry and cherry with some earthy undertones and some mushroom. And for those of you who guessed Pinot Noir, you were right on. I had some excellent guesses. Some people guessed Burgundy, some people guessed Pinot from the Loire Valley, but the correct answer was actually Pinot Noir from Oregon, right here in the US. And the version that I chose was Oregonia. Now, one of the clues that I think people will pick up on if they go back and listen to last time's episode was that this had slightly higher alcohol because it's a little bit warmer climate and slightly lower acidity than say a Burgundy Pinot Noir would. So congratulations to Peter Guestella for being the first person to win a customized Day Drinking with Kevin t-shirt. And I hope and wish all of you good luck in this week's contest. So, what's in my glass? Today's wine is a clear white wine with no evidence of gas or sediment. It's clean on the nose. I would say the color is very pale straw with hints of green and silver on the nose. Pronounced grapefruit, citrus flavors maybe gooseberry, grass, herbal notes. And on the palate, this wine is dry, medium bodied. And I, I would emphasize here the mouthwatering acidity, the juicy citrus notes, and I don't sense any use of oak on this wine whatsoever. The structure of this wine, I would say the alcohol is medium plus. The acidity is definitely high. This wine is a young wine. It's made by a high quality producer. And I would say that it is a drink now wine, definitely not eligible for any aging. So what's in my glass? As with any contest, certain rules apply and YouTube is no different. So YouTube makes us read the following rules. First of all, YouTube is not a sponsor of this contest and viewers must release YouTube from all liability related to this contest. Next, you must be a subscriber to Day Drinking with Kevin in order to win. Only one entry per person is allowed. Only one winner per household. Day drinking with Kevin will not be responsible for any technical glitches. Your data will not be sold to any third parties. We value your privacy. The winner will be selected based on the date and timestamp of the email to daydrinkingwithkevin at gmail.com based on Eastern Standard Time. In the event of a prize becoming unavailable, one of equal value may be substituted. And finally, Day Drinking with Kevin has the final say on all prizes and reserves the right to cancel the contest at any time. If you liked today's episode, please consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribing for free to Day Drinking with Kevin. And I would really appreciate it if you would share this YouTube link with your friends. Until next time, I say, Salute.